Hi everyone, I'm Shara Roman, and I'm also a mom to two high schoolers, a wife of a retired Marine, a board member, an entrepreneur, uh, the founder of the Silverine Group, a culture consulting firm. I'm originally from Bombay, India, but I moved around a lot from India to Nigeria, to the UK, to Greece, and finally the US. Moving around so much always made me feel like a guest in somebody else's country. And that resulted in a certain awareness um, to the need to adapt to different cultures. But it also gave me the ability to understand the potential that when people from vastly different backgrounds come together, they can create amazing impact. So after a career in corporate HR, I knew that I wanted to do something different, something that would really have more impact, both in my community and beyond. And so I set out on my own path and I founded the Silverine Group with the intention to help leaders purposefully create and build company cultures that foster a sense of belonging so that we can each bring our talents and our strengths and all that we have to offer to bear in our organizations and ultimately deliver value to our clients, to our members, or to other stakeholders. I'm excited when I'm able to help CEOs and other leaders reimagine a different kind of workplace. Um, but what really gets me excited when I'm not working is um, cheering my son from the sidelines of a soccer game or watching my daughter's dance recital. Um, but in any, in any case, I'd love to connect. And so I offer to you to reach out if you're interested in, in talking about any way that we can help you. Hi, I'm Shara Roman. I'm the founder of the Silverine Group, and we work at the intersection of people, strategy, and culture to optimize organizational performance. Essentially, we help leaders build workplaces where people want to come and work and stay because they feel valued. Because when we center our culture around people, great things happen. In so many companies, the way things are done hasn't changed in decades. And I mean decades. It feels like a time warp. And that's why we are so passionate about disrupting the way we've always done things, mentalities, and working with leaders on reimagining a culture that drives longevity and success. So we do this by assessing and designing and aligning around aspirational and inclusive culture. We do this through organization design and strategy. We do this by helping leaders to build diverse and inclusive workplace cultures. And we do this by using predictive analytics to create talent-centric solutions, people-centric solutions. So if your organization is struggling to keep up with the changing times, or if you simply need a tune-up, we have you covered. Reach out and we'd love to talk. So what does the future of business look like in the wake of a global pandemic or in the wake of any crisis? It's become clear that people expect more from their leaders and their organizations. Gone are the days where systemic injustice can go unnoticed. With so much unrest and disruption, we now have a rare opportunity to reconsider the systems and values that shape our future workforce. We answer questions such as, what role does a business play in the face of a global socioeconomic crisis? What implications does this have for your organization and its culture? What can we do to strengthen our organizations and our communities? In order to understand the answers to these vital questions, we have to explore the past, the present, and the future of the business landscape and transform our way of thinking. My signature talk, Disrupting Stale Culture, a Fresh Approach to the Future of Work, seeks to understand the changing business landscape and provides actionable solutions any leader can implement to thrive in the face of a crisis.